Well, welcome back, everybody. Uh, episode 22. Now, where we left last time, we have the Condor stationed just outside of our new space station, which we stole from the Russians. And it's looking pretty <laughs> sweet, but we're going to expand that this episode. <laughs> yeah, I know. We're also going to fix the landing gear on this thing because it's jiggling everything about all over the place and we can't stand it. Um, we also need to start doing some sort of an expedition to locate at least where the platinum is on the surface of Mars and maybe bring back some ice so we can start refueling our hydrogen because we're down to 6%, is that right? Yeah, pretty much. It's saying 6 at least. Okay. Right, so let's get on with it. Whoa, let's why am I flying on. away? No, I'm flying away. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you get it roughly where we'd want to dock, we can start working on work building some sort of docking collar. That'll do, actually. Right where you are. Yep, right here. I can here. work with that. Yeah, I can work with that. Okay, okay thrusters cool. off. Right, I'm going to build a docking collar to start going through to Whoa. the cargo bay. Okay, the station is overwriting the... Oh, I didn't know we were upside down. Damn, okay. Station gravity is overwriting the ships. Oh. We need to kill the station. Well, at least align the station gravity. Well, I'm just um, gonna flip the ship. That means the ship's upside down. <laughs> didn't re wait, realize. Is it upside down? Yeah. Oh, it is, isn't it? Yes, it is. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, you should have room to roll it. Oh wait, I have the fucking thrusters off. Yeah. Yeah, you you can do the thrusters off. Just roll it. Oh, look at that. Like, the light that. shines nice. in there too. Nice. Okay, so I'll put a docking collar from here. And then we can line the ship after. Yeah, I think that should be in line, more or less. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Um, wait, what the fuck was that? What? I think... Is there an enemy here? Might be. The laser just splashed. Oh. Probably just destroyed something. What the hell's this floating up here? A magnetic plate floating in midair. Oh, I need energy. Or we could park further forward and have the rear compartment attached to it. Whichever we fancy at the time, I guess. We leave room for both. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it might be difficult with the engines being there, but... It uh, should be fine, I think. Yeah, there's enough space there now, I think. Oh yeah, because yeah, the engine will cook it off, won't it? That should be fine. Yeah. Um, I need to put a floor on this, so... we have to lose that screen. I think. Oh, maybe not. I have to lose these lights. What if we made it extendable? Extendable is difficult. I'm no, thinking extendable is difficult because, like, if we do that, uh, we're probably going to end up inducing wobble on the whole ship. Oh, I guess, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because it's not so upgrade. Fuck. It's. See, this annoys me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that should get us right up to the door. Nice. Watch yourself on the welder. It's green gun. No, on my welder. <laughs> What's up with your welder? No. No, you, ne you nearly flew into it. You'd have hurt yourself. <laughs> Where's the landing gear down again? I don't know. We're going to have to take those off anyway. Let's just demolish the landing gear. Let me let me build something in place of these. I'll, I'll take these off. Okay. 
and I'll replace them with a cooler system. Yeah, that docking collar works okay. Um, right. Let's see. Yeah, that's pretty dope. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I literally walk straight in. I'm thinking though. It might still be a good idea to put a mag plate on the ship, then we can control it. Yeah. Yeah, we can't do that easily. Okay, let me finish off this get, landing gear, though. It doesn't going to change a lot, anyway. No. It's just going to be a little can, load there. We can colour it to match, it's fine. I want um, some, like, status lights here instead. Right, so... How do I want to do this? Well, you need to better hide it, and I. So if you just put it so, like a normal landing gear is just, yeah, you know, the I'm two thinking. blocks from the, where it is right now yep. on the floor. Yep, yep. What I need to do is I need to build a prototype that I can use as you know add on to a projector for for the idea yeah. that I've got to work. Well, I mean, you should be able so, to hide the projector yeah, anywhere. Yeah, so I just need to. Build it. I just need to build it out here separately. So, um, if I do like, if I put yeah, like a large like two, grid, two blocks down, like one landing gear from the, where the thrusters are, like, yeah, if you placed it on the thrusters right now, yeah, what I'm gonna do, I just need to actually, all I need, what am I doing? That's stupid. Uh -oh. Gee, landing gear. Isn't the maglock gonna need... still like shake the ship there? No, they're oh. stable as ever. Okay. If I place a landing gear there and then literally blueprint that, there's plenty of. If you take out the front landing gear anyway, there's like plenty of mm -hmm. room in here. Yeah, I'm building the projector for it. Energy. Oh, energy. Energy. Oh, no energy. Are you? Okay. Okay. Full energy, yeah. Yeah, this first one's going to be a bit of a tough build because it's trying to work out where everything's going to go to make it work right. Uh, but after that, it shouldn't be a hard one. Is that going to be close enough? Let's test it. Oops. Just recolor the weapon. <laughs> Did not mean to do that. Mm -hmm. Right, I want to see, just test if that's close enough to build that gear. It's, it's close enough. Okay. Good. So now all we need is the grinding component to take it back down again when we don't need it. Um, Do that. I'll figure it out. Is the welder even hooked yeah. up properly? That's oh. on. Yeah, that welder's on. Yeah, it'll hurt you. Um, but like resources the idea, otherwise. Yeah. Yeah, it's on resources, it's fine. Um, it, there's two pipes, one going over the top and one going underneath. You, if you just put the landing gear back on this side instead and then on the further back you just put the grinder. Well, I was thinking of just attaching the grinder to that second conveyor. So, like, just... Yeah, why won't that go there? Oh, because the amount of space the gear takes up. Yeah, possibly right. 
they just have to put the fucking ground oh. behind it, dude. Oh, well. The fuck was that? There's an interior plate. What's the um, range the color the grinder works in? Is it just uh, a bit? It's like one, two blocks. But Does it go sideways? Fine. I'll I'll get this. Okay. Energy. Right, I think what I've got should work. Yeah. Tower of Merlin. <laughs> Don't cry about it. Dude. They're all freaking out. Yeah. It's like four kilometers out, though. Where's Baldrin? Oh, down there. Baldrin's like dangerously close to us. Yeah. Yeah, but it should get ripped a new one soon anyway. As soon as it comes into the range. Yeah. Well, we've got asteroid most of the way around us covering our blind sides. So we should be okay. Right. So in theory, this should actually do the job. I've left it stripped back, so hey, how do you like see this? the workings. Where? What? Where are you? Check out the ship inside. Oh, you're still on the landing gear? Alright, it's great. Yeah, I'm there. Don't know where you are. Just now, you will see when you get in. Um, which part of the ship are you at? I'm in the back. Okay. It's trippy oh. having the rub in there. You've done this in wood? Yeah. It's kind of cool. It's a bit pirate shippy. Sure. Well, I think it's more like modern, but yeah, I got to get yeah. to go for the side that pretty bang you know. Very cool. Just need some it's some wood lighting, I think. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. Right. Let's have a look at this and see if it works. Let's just check if it welds it first. So the welder okay. turns on. Builds our gear. Does the welder go any higher? No. Um, no. I might be able to place it in the gap and weld, put it higher up. It's not building that gear, is it? Yeah. Okay, so we'll remove the welder. Come out of here. They oh. just saw the counter and fucked up. Yeah. Uh, I'm full. I'm dropping components everywhere. We could when we got our limits sorted out though. Right, so that's built. The welder can now be turned off. Now we turn the grinder on and see what it takes out. I hope they love this block. Okay. It's not taking that out. It's not close enough. I think it has to be pointed at it directly. Yes, okay. So That's we make an adjustment. Yeah, yeah, because it takes all oh, the shit. space it oh. actually takes. There uh -huh. go the oh, there go the lasers. Yeah. Oh yeah, one thing that's not good about mm -hmm. being docked is it's not the way. It yeah. Me. What's the range on the gets? Because that's pretty far. It's like two clicks away. Uh, yeah, about 1.5. It's getting destroyed by the lasers. It reached so far, mm. dude. There's no way that's not going to work. Look at that. That's neater. Yeah. Assuming you can right. grind it let's, like that. Let's test it. Let's test it. Right, so welder. And the thing is, though, it keeps the stuff inside its own inventory. Oh. I've only got 10 energy left, so I'll have to... That looks pretty neat when it's welded. Yeah. Right. Now I can turn that off. I don't think that... And then... It's gonna, like... It's gonna be... Grinder. Yeah. You can't grind blocks like that, I think. Oh, it can't... I know why. 
I don't think you can grind blocks that are on your own grid. So we might have to slightly subgrid it. Right, okay, let's try that. Right, so that's gone, and then obviously the projector would turn off. We just need to find a way of hiding that grinder a little bit better. Mm. Maybe swap the welder and the grinder around. I think if we swap the welder and the grinder around, it should be fine. Just thinking outside the box, at least this way yeah. outside the box. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Okay, let's do another test. Rolled up. It's orange stuff, first. Mm -hmm. It's kind of cool, isn't it? It works. I mean, does it grind it right? We've got to find out. It does. Or does it? Yeah. yeah. You can swap it. Can you rotate that thing or not? Does it grind it? Does it make a difference? It doesn't make yeah. a physical difference. Oh, then do it. Uh, oh, do you want it? Oh, if you want to do it just because it looks better. Okay. Well, we, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. That's <laughs> ah. There's going to be so Pretty much shit stuff. hanging around down there. How far do you think it goes? Don't know. There. Probably forever. Mm -hmm. No, no. There's there's asteroid surface down there that it'll land on. Unless it bounces off. Right, I'm gonna see where all these bits are fall into. <laughs> Good luck. Oh, they're all here. Yeah. I haven't got room in my inventory though. I don't know what to tell you. I'm just going to empty out and then go get them, I guess. <laughs> we'll leave the welder block on whenever the landing gear is deployed, so if it gets any damage, yeah. it stays repaired. Mm -hmm. um. Oh, I am hearing... Dangers. Nope. Me too. Dangerous is. Right. I think the air is still kind of waking in mm. there. Right. They're not going to hurt us. Oh, I'm hearing laser I fire. Hear things firing. Yep. Space fast. What oh, the hell's going on out there? Is it mad? Oh, my. Right. It's going to be dead. We're set up, so all we need to do is bind two controls, one for landing gear deploy, one for landing gear retract. Yeah. So I'll go up to the cockpit and set those up. OK, 
Okay, we're going to do a test on building the gear. So I'm going to start with the uh, projector off. So, right. That's what it looks like normal. Don't know if you're anywhere near there. I'm in the cockpit right now. So. Uh, I'm trying to get the connector repaired because it's like shot to shit. Oh. Oh, yeah, there you are. Tiny little you next to the big connector. <laughs> what? You don't really see everything scale until you see third person outside the ship and uh -huh. see you trying to repair something. Looking teeny tiny. <laughs> right, I'm just going to do a test run of this. Right, landing gear deploy. Right. Okay, let's try this again. Okay. Deploy. Trigger now. I wonder if it is the grinder. Isn't it on the other side completely? Yeah, but it might, because it's on a subgrid, it might just be sort of leaning over into the wrong grid, the wrong mm -hmm. square. Um, oh, I get it. Okay. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Well, think, what if you take it out? Just yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try... Well, let me just get rid of what's in my inventory first. And I'll just take it out and see if it builds. Yeah. Yeah. So, what I need to do... Is... I know exactly what I need to do. Right, you know what? I'm going to put heavy armor panels in the fucking... <laughs> connector. Yeah. Why not? I don't know why I didn't think of this the first time. <laughs> I'm like mad on hinges. Do you mean? Well, put a grinder on a hinge so it can be out of the way when it needs to be out of the way. Well, I was, this wasn't what I was talking about. Yeah, you talk about like piston or moving out of the way as so well. I, was, I was, wasn't thinking hinge, I should have been thinking hinge, but I wasn't. The hard part about this is making sure it doesn't grind down the ship in the process. Yeah. Right, let's test this again. As with all engineering projects, try it. If it don't work, fix it, test it. Right, so that's not built right now, so I need to turn that off to start. Okay, I need a witness for this. So I'm going to try it from the um, cockpit. So I need you near the front gear. Yeah, just let me finish this. It's almost done. Yep. Yep. Check this out, Dean. Hang on. Let me swivel my camera. Where are you? <laughs> Told you I would charge it again, Dean. What, what am I looking for? Back of the ship. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's nice. That piping actually looks good. Although it's yeah. not symmetrical, but it's cool. Yeah, it's on purpose, dude. That's awesome. 
it's just temporary it's just like fucked on yeah no screw it let's keep it looks good <laughs> well it's like tacked on to one of the ion engine outputs so once that's oh. complete it's going yeah okay we might have to find a way of doing it without that but like i like the idea of the piping that's cool Hmm. Okay, and retracting. That's pretty safe timing. Yeah, that was pretty good. Okay. Woohoo. My idea works. Yeah, it's crazy. Nice. But it works. Yeah, it's, it's interesting, but yeah, it works. <laughs> interesting is <laughs> a good word. Um, okay. Cool. Okay, so what else was on our list? Uh, we need to get some ice into this thing and. It's probably going to have to go on the uh, Robin. Oh, the Robin, yeah. I think we get some ice in here. We can... Is there anywhere we can put... We can butt mine. <laughs> do what? We can put it on the back and do butt mining. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I think I know what I can do. Um... Uh -huh. Conveyors, small conveyors. There we go. The red robin's got hands. It was? The red robin now has hands. <laughs> Great. Looks janky as fuck, but it works. It's not a big ice deposit. It'll do the trick. Shouldn't the inertia tensor be on on this thing? Mm -hmm. Pretty sure it should be on the inertia tensor. Yeah. Um, I'm just wondering something else as well. That's got ice in it. Oh. Not all the cargo containers are connected to each other, are they? Or are they? Uh, they are connected. It's just they are not. They not might not might be not a medium connection. Yeah, not everything can pass cargo through because I've mined it so these drills are full. And they're not passing through to some of the cargo containers. It should. Yeah. It's, it's green. Hmm. I mean, the pipes look green to me. That means it's connected, right? Uh, the pipes are green. They're fine. They're passing to some cargo containers, but some of them aren't getting anything. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go connect to this thing. Whoa! What's <laughs> up? It started trying to throw me around everywhere. Is it locked? It's actually off. I'll try now. They're good. No. There you go. Uh, no, it's not shaking. It's, yeah, that the Ethernet turns around. That's probably why. Yeah. It lines up perfectly it as well. It could have made it shorter too. Nah, not with it lining up the way it does. Good thing there's no such thing as structural integrity here. <laughs> 
Yeah. This ship would just fall apart. Slow down. <laughs> okay, I got about eight about eighty thousand there. It's on burn. Yeah. Just need to make sure that the um Oh shit. Oh, there's something two and a half kilometers out. It's probably going to get shot. Well, if they fly around here, they are going to have a bad time. Yep. Okay, got a hundred thousand ice this time. That's the Voyager. Uh, it's still around the other side of the asteroid. The Voyager. How big is that thing? Probably big. What if I go near it? It's gonna kill me. It's probably gonna kill me. Yeah. Well, it's got a certain yeah. threat. Certainly threatened to kill you. <laughs> oh, it's coming round pretty quick. Oh, it's the colors firing. Yeah. Oh, it's quite big. It's <laughs> big. It's running away. Yeah, it's going away. <laughs> it's probably not as big as our ship. Uh, you can still pretty much see it pretty well. It's like three and a half clicks away. Hang on, let me get a Gatling tower turret and look at it. Fly next to it, Mr. Shea. That's risky. Oh, it's a dizzy little thing. Alright, I'm actually going to go after it. The boss will never believe this book. I'm going after it. Okay. <laughs> I'll make some slight modifications here. I'm only going to get close enough for my lasers to fire. Just to harass it a bit. Let's see if I can kite it back this way. Probably back. Oh shit, firing at me. Firing at me. Still running away. Is it the Voyager? Yeah. It's threat level seven though. What? Is it big? Yeah. That's quite large. I'm gonna go fuck it up. What with? With the Connor. Oh right. It's probably gonna despawn soon. Yeah, I'm gonna catch up dude. It's got about a 1.8 kilometer range on its weapons-ish. So 
all your I think singing it stopped that moving. I need to fuck it up first, right? It's dead in the water. I've stopped it moving. Oh. Uh, are you there? I don't see you. I'm like really close to it. I have no visual on you. I think I've killed its power. Oh, I'm shooting. <laughs> <laughs> did it fucking hit me? You hit me, dude. Oh, jeez, it just moved. Careful with your fuel. Are you right? <laughs> Turn your O2 gens on. It's saying it's all on. Right, good. Careful with those lasers. <laughs> Some of them are coming, like, feel like they're coming quite close. Is it still coming? I think it's only moving under momentum now. Being very close to me. God, I'm actually pretty fucked up. What the hell was that firing? He must have taken out his power, his battery. The last one. He's gone. Right, we need to find our way back to the asteroid now. <laughs> Do you remember where it was? Yeah. That's not a lot of fuel left. Nope. You've got about a hundred, well, nearly two hundred k of ice on board, so you will eventually recoup your fuel. I don't know but why we really it's not do need to make like it refueling right now, probably. Yeah, well, you're using it probably as quickly as it can make it. Well, that ship just like died. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't even recognize what it was. It was like that car. Well, it's pretty well armored. Yeah. It, the landing pad on the counter looks pretty fucked. Oh shit, we love this. We lost um, spicy the meatball. Oh. Alright. Just put some else there. Well, actually, no, that was a really good gun. We should put that back, shouldn't we? Yeah. <laughs> It looked like oh, shit, but it was good. I mean, if we could put like a rail gun there, that would be pretty sick too. Yeah, it'd be fixed though. Which will make it pretty useless for that ship, because it's not agile enough. Yeah, I can line up at least a shot, and if it can achieve that can rip through shit, then... Yeah. Right, let's see what got damaged on this. I lost a few bits of something, but I think it was just random is off. armor. Yeah, I think that might be what I lost. Uh oh. What? <laughs> you run out of fuel? No. I've got. It's coming in too fast. Down. <laughs> uh, 
Uh-oh. Um, mm, please stop. <laughs> You're out of fuel. Oh, I'm what, like 1%? It's so slow at slowing down. Me. Right, go very, very slow and save at least what? At least like some fuel for stopping. So go very slow so you don't plow into something and not be able to stop. It's generating fuel slowly too. Yeah. It will be enough for station keeping. We need at least like a repair wall or something. Hmm. Even that, the thing is with that shape ship, it's going to be a Try it tough to do. Maybe we make like a pre shaped wall for it. <laughs> yeah. One that sort of clamps shut over the ship and repairs it. Yeah. Like a clamshell sort of thing. Like a forge yeah. cast. Yeah. <laughs> you could actually build the ship that way as well. That could be epic, dude. It's just like fucking this big ass fucking yeah. thing just clumps on the ship, dude, brain. This would look insane. I'm like slowly making my way there, like three meters yeah, per second. I'm on board, sort of. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I can yeah, see you're wor working out. Yeah, I'm literally just welding up bits that got broken. Some pretty good acceleration now in those extra engines. Yeah. Just you wait till you get everything working. Oh, it's so fucking dark there, dude. Why is this? Yeah. Am I the right way around? Am I up I'm upside down again, aren't I? Uh, no. You're fine. No? I think. I'm upside down. No, you're upside down. Yeah, I parked upside down. So don't go by where my ship is. <laughs> you had to throw all it that way. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, you just smacked into oh, the asteroid. <laughs> Why are you so long? Why did you have to park this thing so far into the fucking asteroid, bro? Because it's protected. Protect my ass, dude. Mm. Yeah, we need that right. shield. Yeah, so we need platinum, basically. So We should probably get down to Mars, right? Yes. It's like right there. So next time we are going to be heading down to Mars and hopefully we're going to find platinum. Uh, we're going to need to build a large refinery down there and maybe we'll be taking the Condor down with us. So thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.